We met Cassidy um, through our uh, lab rescue organization. Our fearless leader called us because we're fosters and um, said, we have a dog for you, come on up. So we went up and a lot of times you don't really know that much about a dog or your foster until you meet him. So um, she was limping on uh, three legs. So uh, when we take a dog into rescue, we go right to the vet and the vet said that she needed hip surgery. So we had her the first seven weeks of her uh, rescue and we uh, had her through two surgeries. Uh, the first one, she was ready to go. We got her all, you know, ready for therapy. And uh, at her uh, final vet check, they discovered that it didn't quite work. So she had to go through a second surgery. And anyway, uh, she did and um, she never once complained. All she has to do is look you in the eye with her soulful eyes in her ears and uh, she's always been a really good girl yeah i mean i i thought uh i thought she was uh, kind of amazing she went through these two surgeries and right after the first surgery you know she's supposed to be she's not supposed to be ambulatory she's supposed to stay in her kennel because you know we could have she could have some issues with the surgery she was always a hundred percent happy um, there were times that, you know, she would make a move and it would hurt her, but she wouldn't complain. Uh, the only time she would complain is if she couldn't stay with us in our bed. <laughs>
17th full-time foster and we've had I'm retired so a lot of times I'll pick a dog up take it and keep it for two three days to, before the weekend and then uh, uh, another foster will take her uh, take the dog permanently and there's been 20 of those so I, I when you have dogs you might have three or four dogs in your lifetime we've gone through over 30 and it, you just learn all these different traits and, and behaviors and uh, like I said if uh, uh, I've learned just a, a tremendous amount, and, and our volunteers are great. You can reach out to them, and we network on a private Facebook page, and there are probably 15, 20 posts a day on that, and you can you can ask for help. Uh, you need to find something. You need food. You need whatever. So it's a great networking tool for us.